The Jedi bought us some time. Get our wounded to the secure area. Move it! I'm the chief medic. Just call me Doc. I appreciate your hard work, Gorgeous. But there's a whole nest of colicoids coming. No time to evacuate. We'd never let anything bad happen to a nice guy like you. Not even if I asked nicely? I've got dozens of wounded here. Hope you're not one of those junior Jedi. We have to save him too. I'll head for the secure area and stabilize casualties. Here they come! Hey, look at that. We are alive. Nice work. A lot of wounded here. You're the only doctor? Honey, I do the work of ten medics. And that's on a bad day. Say, you might be wounded and not know it. Let me check you over. I feel fine, but you're the doctor. Let's see. Uh-huh. Hmm. Well, you'll certainly need a more thorough exam. Later. I don't know what genius picked a colicoid breeding ground for our medical facility. But we need to evacuate quick. Problem is, my critical patients are too fragile to move. And the Empire stole my trauma kits. I won't let the Empire endanger your people's lives. How can I get what you need? Our scouts say the Imperials sent my trauma kits to their frontline troops on the plains nearby. The depots will be heavily guarded, but I'm sure you'll figure something out. Just hurry. These people don't have much time. I got as many trauma kits as I could find. Beautiful. The, uh, kits look good, too. He's a walking hormone. Apologies for being late. My detour around those Imperial forces took longer than expected. I was worried. Glad you're here. You've done well saving this facility and its patients. The Resistance has already agreed to help us find the cloaking device prototype. The super advanced gadget you're after? The Resistance can narrow down its location, but we need access to the enemy's computer network. The only connection point is at Sobrick, which is covered in Imperial forces. Troop legions, walkers, heavy bombers. Fun place. Sounds pretty important. Why all the protection? It's the manufacturing capital of the planet. All the best guns get made there. I believe we can diminish the Imperial forces without firing a shot. The Empire has several comm relays around Sobrik tied to other Imperial strongholds. An early warning system. Great. When we attack, they can summon more troops to kill us. Or we make the Imperials think we're attacking their other strongholds. We'll infiltrate those comm relays, upload fake alerts, and siphon away Sobrik's defenders, leaving it vulnerable. If the Empire thinks it's under attack, won't they tighten Sobrik's defenses? Sobrik's commanders are noted for their aggressive tactics, and they'll have every reason to believe they're secure. The comm relays are protected by advanced Imperial war droids. Very fast, extremely deadly. I'm no longer quick enough to defeat those war droids. But you are. Then the Resistance can raid the Empire's computer network. We'll figure out where they've stashed that whatchama thingy it you want. Use this data pad on the comm relays to upload the fake emergency signals. I'll find a good vantage spot to watch Sobrik and keep you informed of our progress. Be careful out there. Perfect. Sobrik's defenses have been reduced to the bare minimum. The resistance team is heading in. I think it's best if you follow and keep an eye on them. Too much is riding on this mission. Sounds like you don't have full faith in the resistance. The data they're recovering is essential to finding the cloaking device prototype. This may be our only chance. The Resistance team identified a vehicle depot as their best access point to the Imperial computer system. Transmitting the grid coordinates now. I'll continue monitoring Sobrik. If I see trouble, I'll alert you immediately. Keep our new friends safe. Over and out. Have you accessed the Imperial network? Already downloaded everything. 
We were leaving when the Imperial Medical Transport landed for refueling. Avers and his men opened fire. Belmer and scum. Murderers. My men are dying. We'll never reach the med center now. You just made my season, Imp. Bet you've got some choice gear on that transport. Greedy vermin! These soldiers were defending Balmora! There's a doctor here. He could keep your men alive. You just love irony, don't you? Do you read? Colicoid nests stirred up by fighting. Waves of them headed for Sobrik's outskirts. Leave now or you'll be surrounded. They'll rip us apart! Every man for himself! Move! We can't flee! Those beasts will kill us! I don't abandon wounded men, even Imperials. Then again, being eaten wasn't on my agenda for today. Save these soldiers if someone keeps the colicoids off me. You work your medical magic. I'll take on the colicoids. May the force be with us. If we die, at least it'll be heroic. But we're not gonna die, right? You hear that? They're here! <laughs> I've done some crazy things, but this beats them all. That was heroic. These men owe you their lives. So do I. I want every Imperial on Balmora to know how a Jedi and a Resistance Doctor saved your lives. I'd never falsify a report, no matter how distasteful. Leaving here would be a lot easier if there was another transport. Actually, I did see a speeder bike outside. Only seats one. Hmm. You're honestly thinking about leaving me here? You'll be fine. You got one of those laser sword things. Your friend warns at these coordinates. I'll meet you there. Good luck. I hear you two had quite an adventure in Sobrik. I'm impressed by your commitment to saving lives. We make a pretty great team. We should do this more often. Our mission isn't over. What's the next step? This is Nicolan Cord, one of the top resistance leaders. He analyzed the data we obtained from Sobrik, found us a lead. One of our spies was captured weeks ago, attempting to steal what might be the Empire's cloaking device project. The data revealed where she's being held. Sounds like someone we should talk to. How do we free her? We believe she's inside an Imperial Tactical Operations base. Heavily fortified, protected by a regiment of troops. That's where I come in. Colonel Finley commands the Republic's 5th Expeditionary Force. He's agreed to assist our operation. Trouble is... If that tech op space crew sees my troops marching in, they'll close the blast shields. Those shut, there's no getting them open. If the enemy seals the base, we lose our connection to the cloaking device prototype. One of you Jedi could slip inside, disable the blast shields before they close, then the base would be ours. We'd have to distract that Imperial regiment, create an opening. My troops provide quite a distraction. The Resistance must be part of this. Our spy won't talk if I'm not there. I'll escort the Resistance. That leaves you to penetrate the base and deactivate those blast shields ahead of our arrival. Get your forces ready, Colonel. We leave immediately. I can guarantee an enthusiastic response. I'll prepare my forces to move out. That Resistance leader. Let's keep an eye on him. His spy is the key to our victory, and he knows it. Get inside the Empire's base and deactivate those blast shields. We'll be waiting for your signal. Bad news, my friend. The Empire just landed heavy war droids in the region. Hunter killers. The droids are patrolling the territory between you and the objective. If they detect you heading for that Imperial base, they'll raise an alert.
risk the base's blast shields closing before you get there. You'll have to disable those war droids quickly. Scrapped Imperial war droids coming right up. I'm sending the latest reconnaissance data on the war droids' positions. Eliminate them and continue on to the Imperial base. Never a dull moment. We should visit war zones more often. There, you have the data. Be careful. Over and out. Warren, I've disabled the base's blast shields. It's wide open for you. We're almost there. The Colonel Finley detects a reactor surge coming from the base. Looks like the base commander initiated a self-destruct sequence. You don't have much time to stop it. Shut down all the security consoles in there as fast as you can. Hurry! Self-destruct aborted. The base is ours, Warren. Send in the troops. What are you doing here? I'm busting you out, sweetheart. Where else would I be? I'm sure the Imperials weren't kind to your friend. Make sure she's all right. We thought we'd lost you, Metal. She's healthy as ever. Life signs green across the board. That's a relief. Mattel, what have you learned about the Empire's cloaking device? Imperial scientists left Balmora with the prototype when the Republic invaded. It's long gone. Mattel, I sense great conflict within you. I know you're lying. What are you afraid of? Wait just a minute. She's one of us. Warren wouldn't accuse her of lying unless he was certain. The truth will come out. Wouldn't you rather be the one who reveals it? When Nicolin hears the truth, he'll want to kill me. Promise you'll stop him. No one will hurt you. Tell us everything. Take it easy. Whatever this is, we'll work it out. The Empire offered me a deal. Cooperate or die slowly. I told them everything about the Resistance. Names, locations, plans. I knew it. The Empire has been slaughtering our people using your information! Give them something they can use. Tell them about the cloaking device. The Empire is studying it at the Balmoran Arms Factory. It's there, I promise. What kind of security does this Balmoran Arms Factory have? Their defense grid's the tightest on the planet. I got in, but I couldn't get out. You know the price of betrayal. Wait, she has enemy intelligence. She could be an asset. Finley needs information on the Empire. You work for him now. I'm sorry, Nicholas. I had no choice. Metal was ours to punish. The Resistance will not forget this insult. Neither will I. Thanks for saving her. I owe you. The Balmoran Arms Factory is the Empire's biggest stronghold. Assaulting this base was one thing, but taking on that fortress... I know that place inside out. Need a shortcut through that Rancor's den? Well, I'm your man. What would a medic know about a weapons factory? Ran a hospital there when it was resistance territory. I still know people inside. His knowledge and expertise will come in handy. Take him with you. Hey, if the Imperials attack with grenades, you can throw Doc on them. Colonel Finley and I will coordinate a full offensive against the Empire. We'll clear you a path to the Balmoran Arms Factory. The rest is up to you. Get that cloaking device prototype at all costs. May the Force be with us. Turbo lift's locked down, but don't worry. Slicing Imperial security codes is a hobby of mine. Give me two secs. Someone's coming down the turbo lift. Get behind me, beautiful. I'll protect you. Doc, I thought the amps had killed you. You too, Remy? How you making out, old fella? Same as always. 
pretend to cooperate with the Imperials, and stab them in the back every chance I get. We're here to defeat the Empire. Can you get us into the upper levels? Sure. The Imps put me on waste management. Gave me a data card to get in there. It's all yours. Thing is, there's guards every two meters in there. That's why I travel with the Jedi, Remy. Aren't you afraid the Imperials will blame you for this? I have no plans to find out. Not after you opened me a nice, sweet path of freedom. Good luck. Hello. Are you there? It's Colonel Finley. We have a new problem. Resistance has learned of Imperial research into weapons that use cloaking device technology. If the enemy can hide their missiles and bombs from detection, imagine the carnage. The Empire would rip us apart. You must recover all the Empire's research data on this project and deliver it to us. There's bound to be a computer hub up there somewhere. This may be our only opportunity. Do everything you can. Finley out. I found the files about the Empire's stealth weapon research, but something's wrong. They're starting to erase themselves. I use turbo lift data cards all the time when I was here. They work with computers, too. Maybe we can transfer the files onto the data card Remy gave us. Copy them before they get deleted. Worked like a charm. Pretty amazing. Not gorgeous. How did I ever get by without you? Best not to think about it. Those bad old days are over. Oh. You suppose the Empire knows we're here? That's far enough. We're almost done here. Nicolin, what are you doing? The cloaking device prototype belongs to the people of Balmora, not the Republic. This is our world, our war, and our victory. The Empire was on the verge of wiping out the Resistance before we got here. We spent decades fighting for this planet after the Republic rolled over for the Empire. Now you're back to loot our resources? This prototype may be the most valuable technology on Balmora. You're not taking it. Aren't the Jedi all about justice? If that's true, let us leave with what's rightfully ours. The Jedi will return this technology once we're done with it. Please hand it over. The Jedi will return this once they're done with it. Hand it over, Avers. I'd offer you transportation, but I'm afraid the shuttle only seats two. Good luck. Now that's smooth talking. One thing's for sure. I'm not working for the Resistance anymore. Got a spare bunk on your ship for a superb combat medic? I thought you'd never ask, Doc. A gentleman waits for just the right moment. Warren, I have the cloaking device prototype. After the blood that's been spilled today, that's a ray of hope. I'm returning to the Republic base where you first landed. Meet me there. cloaking device prototype and the Empire's weapon research data. We've denied the enemy a considerable technological edge and broken its hold on Balmora. I'll send the research data to Coruscant. There's a Dr. Godera waiting to review it. Friend of yours, I understand. Please, give the doctor my regards. I will. It's been a pleasure working with you. Somehow I expected such an important device to be more impressive. I'll deliver this to Master Braga and the Council on Tython. Master Braga's faith in you is well placed. I'm honored to serve with you. The feeling is mutual. Be well, my friend. You should contact Master Braga when you return to your ship. He's eager to hear from you. Farewell. Master Braga, the mission to Balmora was a success. We have the cloaking device prototype. Outstanding. I never doubted you for a moment. How did you find working with my old friend Warren? I've always been impressed by his keen insights. Warren has a talent for finding the truth. Those gifts are vital to achieving our ultimate goal. 
You've brought us a great leap closer to finding the Emperor. But there's a new problem. I've lost contact with my Padawan under unusual and dangerous circumstances. You're uniquely qualified to deal with this. I'll do everything I can, Master. Tell me the situation. Sejar is no ordinary Padawan. He was once a Sith Lord, a member of the Empire's Dark Council. We dueled on Dantooine. Fought for three days. I won when I convinced him to abandon the dark side and train as a Jedi. You must have taken a lot of persuading. Our debate was a duel in itself. I appealed to the good in him no matter how he attacked me. Sejar has fully embraced the Jedi way. Whatever has happened, it isn't his fault. He was guarding the Republic base on the planet Quish when the Empire invaded and attacked our territories. You trusted Sejar to guard a Republic base in a war zone? When I sent him, Quesh was peaceful, quiet, a good place for meditation while also serving the Republic. I just spoke with a soldier at Sejar's base. It's surrounded by Imperial forces and my Padawan refuses to act. Without Jedi help, that base will fall. My Padawan won't answer his holo. Sounds like he's afraid of something, but what? Only a strong Jedi can help Sejar and save the base. I'm transmitting the planet's coordinates now. Master Bagger, out. Go. He needs you. And you need him. Master? Why would I need Sejar? Uh, you alright? The hollow transmission's over. It's a Jedi thing. None of your business. This sounds urgent. We should go to Quesh right away. <laughs>